He left us. He left my roommate and I in the middle of nowhere in Arizona. Continuing coverage tonight as Fox 17 News is receiving calls from across the country after we broke a story about a Greyhound bus driver in Tennessee abandoning passengers. Passengers in this case, including a baby, were left at a gas station in Jackson. Fox 17 News' Caitlin Miller has been on this story all week and continues to uncover new concerns. Yes, Scott. Well, the power of social media, we're now hearing horror stories from coast to coast, starting with the story that we broke to you from that from passengers traveling from Nashville to Memphis that were abandoned in a gas station. Now new tonight, we're hearing from a woman that's traveling from Hinesville, Georgia to Manhattan, Kansas, and she was left in an open field. And another story of a woman traveling from Los Angeles all the way to Oklahoma City with her roommate, and they were both left in the middle of a desert in Arizona. Fox 17 News first reported a Greyhound driver leaving passengers at a gas station in Jackson, driving off as a woman knocks on the door. This video is why Amanda Harding wanted to share her story about recently taking a Greyhound bus from Hinesville, Georgia to Manhattan, Kansas. Harding says they were supposed to stop in Lawrence, Kansas to switch buses, but explains the bus driver dropped her and another guy off in a field. He said, you guys are going to get off here. I said, this is not right. There's nothing here. It's just an open field. Harding says the stop turned out to be 20 minutes from the actual bus stop. Got our luggage off and told us, have a good day and drove off. Harding and the other passenger flagged down a driver and paid a woman to drive them to the actual bus station. Harding asked Greyhound for help. And they told me that they could not give me a refund for my ticket because services were rendered because the email says the trip was completed. We heard from another Greyhound passenger, Laura Bush in Los Angeles, who was taking the bus with her roommate to Oklahoma City. He made everyone get off the bus because he said he had to clean it. Bush says they took a random bathroom break in a small town in Arizona. She and her roommate grabbed a sandwich and went to the restroom and came out and the bus was gone. Bush says seeing the video that Fox 17 News first shared online from what happened in Jackson fired her up. I relived the trauma. It was, uh, it was, it was like I was. We were living a scary movie. You're dropped in the middle of the desert in the heat, two lane highway, no cars, and again, no refund from Greyhound. I reached out to Greyhound on Monday, Tuesday, and again tonight. I also reached out to the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration that oversees issues with Greyhound to see if they can help step in to help with these issues. Now we want to know if drivers are being held accountable for these actions and why these passengers are not getting reimbursed. I will continue to stay on top of this so passengers can get the answers that they deserve. Reporting live from in studio, I'm Caitlin Miller, Fox 17 News, your Code Red Station. Caitlin, thank you. And toward that end, if you have had an issue with a Greyhound bus on a trip like the ones we've described, we'd like to hear about it. Just scan the QR code there on the left hand side of your screen to get in touch with us. Or you can go to our website, fox17.com. Again, tell us your story. Just scan that QR code there on the screen and it will take you directly to a contact page where you can share your information.